Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Dan. All right, in, in this video, I'm going to be doing a quick update on, you know, my Ube yams, you know, the, the, this, this Korea, uh, Alata, you know, you know, this is the purple yam, you know, you know, I was gifted this by, you know, Essien's Family Garden a couple months ago, so I wanted to show you guys, and I got some questions in the, in the, in my, you know, comments regarding you know some you know there's people that want to see the update of, of what it's looking like now so i want to show you guys all the this korea lata which is also called the ube or the greater yam this is actually a true yam not the purple potato that you guys are used to this is like real true yam you know the leaves look completely different you know so uh, let's walk over there all right let's walk through here okay let's go over here all right, guys, this is how the yam is actually looking. You remember, you guys remember you saw when I did that video, you know, you know, to show you guys how I was planting the yam, and it's doing amazing, like really good. Yeah, it's putting off a lot of new growth, you know, and it's pushing up yeah, right here. It's even pushing up more from the ground here. You know, so guys, this is the, the this Korea alata. This is a, the true yam, not sweet potato. So, you know, it, it's real deep purple, you know, and you could use it, you could boil it, you know, you could do a lot of stuff with it, you know. Yeah. You could make a lot of desserts. So I'll show you guys how, how it's even, look at it right here. It's growing and it's attaching itself to, to look, it's attaching itself to the, 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 the uh, strawberry tree. And if we come come down here, I show you guys. This is uh, 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 there's some grass here. Let me show you. Let's clear this area. Show you some. You see, everything is coming up from the the, the yam on this side. So there's like, let's see. Yeah, even another new growth pushing out right here uh -huh. yep so everything looks healthy so far here because I planted yam on this side of the trellis and I also planted yams let's walk around here on on oh, on the inner okay okay there is this is in the middle okay. Yeah, so there's yam planted over on this side, and then there's some planted right here. Okay, yeah, there's, there's yam planted. Okay, you see that? Good, okay. Yeah, so uh, yam planted on this side, this side. There's two trellis here. So there's one trellis right here, and there's another one here which is shearing <laughs> this trellis is shearing with the butterfly black butterfly pea flower yeah yep yeah so yeah. yeah so it's looking good it's coming right up right up right up yes yeah, so it's actually two two set of vines I mean, I mean one one tube seems like it push about like four vines each you know so that's kind of really good so I'm hoping I'm really hoping for an amazing harvest you know, and the vines grows grow so fast guys let's, let's walk around here this is a vine look see this vine right here I recently just trellis it this 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 younger vine just like maybe three days ago and look how fast it grow overnight it's finding itself way over here and it's actually probably looking to for an extended trellis you know to, to go but it's probably gonna travel right up on on those trees which is good uh, so i'm okay and and if you look at how thick how thick the vines are they like thick and healthy, a healthy looking plant. Yep, and it seems like the you know the hot temperatures don't affect this at all. So 
I mean, if you live in places like Texas and stuff, you know, you could probably try and grow this, you know. Etienne's family garden, he's in Virginia and he grows it. So, you know, you could, you could probably add this to the Discora Alata, the Ube. You should add it to your garden, you know. You know just need a trellis and you're good. I actually bought these trellis to actually let it run up on. Let me, let me walk around here. But it seems like these trellis are not even big enough for it here. So, which is fine. That's the whole purpose of the food forest is having other trees that support other trees. You know, so right now, you know, the mulberry tree and that tree is supporting the, 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 <laughs> the vine spreading. So I'm, I'm, I'm excited about the progression and how it's actually looking. Let me, let me come around here and show you guys. So it's growing and it's looking extremely good. Yeah, so you see, you see the, the, the way the leaves look. Nothing like a sweet potato. This is like the real yam. Yeah, sweet potato, sweet potato. This is the true, true yam. Yep. A lot more nutrients than the traditional sweet potato. Let me show you something while we're here. All right, if you come down here, this is actually a purple sweet potato. You know, yep, this is the big difference. So this is a true, like a deep purple potato right here. I planted in the ground over here in the food forest. And that's started to spread. It's, it's, it's you know, I probably about uh, three weeks now since everything is planted right here. And if we go back over here now, you could see, you could see the, 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 the true, the real yam, you know? Yep. And guys, these are survival crops, you know, okay. You know, any root crop you have, you know, is a form of survival crop. You always have food. Yep, and that's the reason, see, I grew a lot of root crops. Yep, they last long, they could stay in the ground year after year, especially here in Florida. Yep. Look how, look how vigorous the, the, the vine. Look at it, guys. It's attaching itself to everything. <laughs> so, so, which is cool. I kind of like this too because as I just said, one plant is supporting the other, you know. So, the vine is growing up and it's getting supported by the mulberry tree and the other tree right there. Yep. So, all right, guys. So, that was just a quick update. You know, I wanted, you know, my fellow YouTubers who, who asked a question regarding how it's actually, you know, growing and, you know, so... It's a quick update. All right. So thank you so much for watching. All be blessed with peace, love, happiness, and kindness. One love. See you in the next video.